Hey guys, we're Lando from Red Moto. So today we're gonna to be working on this dent right here, on this Outlander. But we're not gonna fix it with ordinary tools that you find at a body shop. We're gonna fix it with this repair kit that you guys actually can find at an automotive store. O'Reilly's, AutoZone, or even Walmart, I believe, carries this. So this one's gonna be the Pittsburgh Automotive Crossbar Dent Repair Kit. So if you guys like this video, go ahead and like, subscribe, and turn on that push notification, and also, if you guys need any prepaid auto body parts for your car, go to redmoto.com, your prepaid auto body parts source. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, so this tool right here comes with this, I believe they call it a crossbar. And then it comes with these like, um, I guess like this is how you put the glue down here. And depending on the dent, utilize either this one or this one right here. I think for my dent, I'm gonna utilize this one because it's kind of concave a little bit. And then it has this twisting knob right here. So I guess this one right here, you pull up, you twist it and it'll pull the dent up. You have yourself a glue gun It comes with glue gun glue. This one right here is the release agent. And then I guess if you pull up too hard, then you guys can knock it down again with this uh, hammer right here. And here's a scraper to scrape off that uh, release agent or the glue. So let me show you guys my dent. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and apply the glue gun. All right, so we're gonna use this. So I'm using this one right here because it goes right in the middle. And if I use this one right here, what it does is it gives it like a big gap. So I don't think it's gonna hold on correctly. So let's go ahead and put that I wonder if that's a special type of glue gun. Right, just hold it down. And you're supposed to put this on there. So when I pull, it's supposed to twist this and then the dent is supposed to go up. Let's see if it does. It feels like it's going up. Oh. Okay. I may have to have, I should have left it on longer maybe? Let's see. Oh, put that away. Mm, if I use two of these jumps. Mm. Like that. Yeah, just be able to scrape it. Oh yeah, that works. That really works. Okay. Let's try this again. Maybe we should try it this way. It just doesn't feel like it's gonna grip. Maybe we start at the top. I'm gonna I'm gonna start up here. Let's see if we start up there again. Glue. Stack. Start the glue. Put the glue right here. Ten seconds. One Mississippi. Two Mississippi. Three Mississippi. 4 Mississippi, 5 Mississippi, 6 Mississippi, 7 Mississippi, 8 Mississippi, 9 Mississippi, 10 Mississippi.
Okay. I feel like it's working. my work I think we need to pull this thing right here so I think we had a work in section so up here went this went up a little bit on there start working our way down Comment down below and let me know if it's actually working because I can't tell. I don't it feels like it's working. I want it to work. This is make your guys' job easier at home. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I'm really putting a lot in there. Crossing my fingers, I really want this to work. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six Mississippi, seven Mississippi, eight Mississippi, nine Mississippi, ten Mississippi, eleven Mississippi, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty Mississippi. Double the map that they told me. Okay, let's try again. slowly pressing up just because I want that glue to stick mm -hmm. I don't know it's just not sticking anymore I don't know what this thing I'm gonna try one more time, but I don't think so. I don't think it's gonna work. We may have to call this one. Maybe it's utilized for smaller dents. I say smaller dents, maybe. But again, this is a large dent, okay, guys? So, whoever made this Pitts Pittsburgh automotive, don't be commenting down below and telling me that I didn't do it right. I am but I think it's just not I don't think this is uh, too big of a dent because I'll be honest if this came into my shop which it actually did come to my shop if, it, if I was actually doing a repair properly I would get a new hood no one got time for this I'm just gonna let it, I'm just gonna let it simmer down. All right. I think that was a good couple minutes. It's super dry now. Super dry. Okay, so now let's, let's try it again. Oh, this one's dry. 
đó rồi hmm. I don't know it's causing a dent right here no it's super dry but now it's causing a dent on the other side it literally caused a dent right here oh my goodness let me see let me rotate this thing oh, that's funny let's see from maybe like this way dang oh it's causing a dent right there that's funny trying to help it. If you let it sit for longer, it's gonna dry up harder. But what's happening is like, these arms are causing a dent on the other side. What is going on? This is too funny. But it is strong though, I ain't gonna lie. It's strong now. But it's still not pulling out my dent. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna pull out my dent. I think my dent is too deep. One thing I did learn is that if you let the glue sit there longer than 10 seconds, it gets really hard and it's really stuck on there. If you guys saw like the previous few times, the uh, glue wasn't really holding down this little thing, but now it is. Oh, hey, I'm gonna say that release agent, this thing, this thing is fantastic. Yeah, unfortunately for this bit, no good. Hey guys, I do want to thank you again for watching our great videos. If you guys need any parts for your vehicle, the ones that you guys see in our videos, or anything else, go to RevMoto.com, your pre-painted auto body parts source. We sell bumpers, tail lights, headlights, uh, touch-up bottles, everything that you need for your vehicle, go to RevMoto.com, your pre-painted and accessories parts store. Also, go ahead and like, subscribe, and turn on your push notification for more great videos like this one. Thank you.